Hi, and welcome to Quirky Books with Katie. Today I'm going to be doing my birthday book haul. So recently it was my birthday, and here are some of the books that I got. First, I got a book of Shakespeare sonnets by William Shakespeare, of course, and this is probably a little bit weird or geeky, but I am currently in an AP literature class and I've been having a little bit of trouble with poetry, so I figured if I can read these and understand Shakespeare sonnets, then I'll have an easier time understanding other poetry. So my goal with this is to kind of just read it and annotate it and kind of just have some more practice with reading poetry. Next is Slated by Terry Terry, and my friend Lexi actually gave this book to me, so thank you Lexi for giving this to me. And Lexi is one of my, I guess, real life friends you can say that likes reading, and she thought that I would like this book. I'm not really sure what it's about. The back says, Kyla's memory has been erased, her personality wiped blank, her memory's lost forever, she's been slated. So it sounds really interesting. It I don't really know what it's about, but if any of you guys read it, let me know in the comments down below because I'm not really sure when I'm going to pick this up. Next is a book that I'm so excited for, and that is Confess by Colleen Hoover. Colleen Hoover is one of my favorite authors. I've read almost all of her books. I've read Maybe Someday, Slammed, Hopeless, Ugly Love, and this book is about a girl that falls in love with a guy that works at an art gallery with her, I believe, and the cool thing about this book is that it actually has some pictures in it. So I know that I'm going to love this because I absolutely adore Adore Colleen Hoover. Her books just are always so emotional and they move me and this book is probably next on my TBR because I'm so excited to read it. Next is Rebel Bell by Rachel Hawkins. Now this book was popular a couple months ago because I believe a Booksplosion read it and this book is about a southern girl named Harper and I guess she kind of finds out that she has these powers and she has to protect this guy that she doesn't like. I've heard really good things about this book. I was a little skeptical about picking it up because it doesn't sound like my thing but I've heard amazing things from a lot of people that I really trust so hopefully it's really good and I'm really looking forward to reading this. Next is Open Road Summer by Emery Lord. This book is probably the book that I'm most excited about reading besides Confess, and this book is about a girl named Reagan who recently broke up with her boyfriend, but then she goes out on tour with her best friend who is a singer, and she falls in love with a guy that is also a singer on the tour. I've heard really good things about this book and I've heard really good things about this author as well. I do currently have an advanced copy of Emery Lord's other book, The Start of Me and You, and that one sounds really good too. And I've heard nothing but good things about this book. I might wait though to read this book until summer so I can enjoy a summer contemporary during the summer. And last but not least is The Bronze Horseman by Paulina Simons. And this book was popular, I'd say about like a year or two ago, and I just heard amazing things about it, and I've always wanted to read it. And I actually have already read this, and this book was absolutely amazing. It's the story of a girl named Tatiana, and she lives in Russia during the start of World War II. And while this war is going on, she falls in love with this boy named Alexander. And this is really just their love story. As you can see, it's a pretty decently sized book. It's over 800 pages. And sometimes I'm scared off by big books, but I actually really enjoyed this and I flew through it. I read it in like five days. And this is just an amazing historical fiction book. I would definitely recommend picking this up. So these are all of the books that I ended up getting for my birthday. If you've read any of them, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day, and I will talk to you again soon.